So friends, uh, we have with us Women International Master from Colombia, Angela Franco. Is this correct? Yes. Okay, yes. so... <laughs> <laughs> because her name in Spanish is different. So she's my wife also, you know that. But anyway, this video is very special because uh, Angie just won uh, the 44th Khelo Chess India tournament, which was our ninth rapid tournament. So Angie uh, was a part of Khelo Chess India journey from very start. So let me ask how she feel about Khelo Chess India journey. So Angie, you won this tournament. First of all, how was the tournament? Uh, super strong. Winning a tournament in India is really tough. So I'm so happy to win this time. Okay. And uh, you played from very start this tournament when we started in 2022. And uh, that time there was not regular tournaments in Bhopal. And we are doing regular tournaments almost every Sunday. Even we did some international events, world record events uh, with FIDE, FIDE 100 tournaments. Uh, overall, how you see uh, this uh, Kelo Chess India? things, how, how the back-to-back -back tournaments are happening. Do you think this will create some future champions? For sure. When I was living in Colombia, uh, I was listening about Anna, about Indian chess, how strong it is. But when I came to India, I got to know, I understood why. And it's because no matter how small, how big is uh, any tournament, uh, the organization is so clean. Uh, everyone is putting all the soul, the heart in the event. So I'm so happy to be part. Okay. When you, uh, first time when NG came to India, uh, that was the time when Sagar, Amrita, myself, me, we are covering the Bhopal International Tournament when you came first time to India. And from that time, Chess Base India is working to promote Indian chess, how how you see how everything is going on these days, how, how Chess Base India is doing right now, Chennai Grandmaster Tournament with MGD1 and Tamil Nadu government, how you see the growth of Chess Base India also? I want to uh, answer in Spanish so I can I can tell you what really I feel, but I will try in English. For me, Chess Base India has a big, big role in the means what, what is happening in India. Why all the uh, Gukesh we have here, Arjun, in in your chess club means why they are so strong now because of their family, because of their discipline, so many things. But for me, Chess Base India has a big role. It's a big part because when I came to India, I saw the the work of Sagar, Abruta, Nicholas, Mikuji. I call him Mikuji. <laughs> uh, and really, and now uh, Kelo Chess India. So I congratulate uh, Chess Base India, you. So this is our 44th event. When we uh, came Bhopal, uh, there was not such tournaments was happening. So we started this Kelo Chess India concept. I discussed with Sagar Bhai and we started then. And back-to-back uh, -back tournaments are happening. And I'm very happy because uh, now tournament is happening even without my presence. My team is conducting the tournament and everything. They are doing very smoothly. So I'm really happy for this. One more co thing I want to inform you. Uh, Angie, one article is soon going to publish in Spanish, but we will translate in English and Hindi also. Angie, you wrote one article. Tell, can you tell me you are starting article writing also in Spanish specifically? Uh, what is your first article title? Okay, my YouTube don't miss that article because it's beautiful from all my heart. Is how I met Gokesh. He's really, even my game is there. How he defeated me when he was 12 years. Okay, so <laughs> that game is there and you wrote the article about Gokesh. So, uh, try to read that article. We will translate in English and Hindi also. And definitely the article, main essence, if you understand Spanish, that will be great for you. Thank you so much, uh, Angie, for talking to us. And I hope... Uh, you will keep winning the tournaments. Thank you. Thank you. And bringing the trophies to my home back. <laughs>